the light source technologies in projector has seen a lot of evolution i mean we started with lamp based projectors then the era came of led projectors then we have the laser projectors now all of these technologies has got their different pros and cons and in our today's video i tanmay mehta your home cinema consultant or home theater wale bhaiya will be sharing with you some of the facts and key differentiating factors between a lamp based projector and a led based projector now this differentiation is very very detailed with regards to the specification as well as the application so make sure to watch the video till the end also those of you who have got so much of questions in your mind with regards to projectors with regards to the technologies then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification because on 14th of september that is thursday at 7:30 pm we are going live again so this is our youtube live session wherein we would be live for around 1 hour or so and we would be answering all of your questions in that live video so i hope to see you all over there and let us now jump on to our video so recently i was scrolling on amazon on various projectors that are available uh, in india and these are all you know budgetary home category that i was looking around and to my surprise i saw some of the crazy projectors which were showing 9000 9500 600 lumens and i was like i have not seen any of these projectors in a normal home category how could they manage to bring it in a price bracket of 20000 rupees and then when i realized and i saw the specs i saw that those are not the real ansai lumens figure the ansai lumens figure is literally divided by 10 to that value so for instance a 9600 lumens divided by 10 960 is the actual ansai lumens now further research led into the first parameter that we are looking at which is the brightness because the brightness of a led projector is always going to be less compared to the brightness of a lamp based projector now typically all these projectors are between 1000 to 2000 lumens and ansai lumens the led ones and the lamp projectors will have minimum 2000 lumens and above as the brightness because lamp as a technology is much more powerful to emit light than a led uh, technology the second main key differentiating factor between led projector and a lamp projector is always going to be the life span because life span is very very crucial because we want projector which will run for a very very longer period of time now that longevity is much more there in a led projector which can go for 20000 to even 30000 hours but when it comes to a lamp based projector on a normal mode probably it will go for 4000 5000 and on economy mode it can at the most go up to 10000 hours so that is the life span of both these projectors led or uh, will always be on the higher side the lamp will always be lower while buying home theater systems we always have this fear that is this going to shoot up my electricity bills well when you buy a lamp based projector it is definitely going to shoot up your bill cause the lamp based projectors have got a power consumption of 250 to minimum 350 watts of power whereas the led projector can start from as low as 100 watts and will not still cross beyond 200 watts for any of the high end projectors as well so led will always be cheaper on the pockets for the electricity consumption whereas the lamp will always be higher now the next main big thing that is very very important for projectors is how good is the color display on the screen now the color displays that you get from a led projector is not going to be as great as a lamp based projector because in a lamp based projector the control on the contrast ratio as well as the effects on the you know various color gamuts is going to be far more superior though there would be certain limitations in the lamp based projectors wherein not all the models can achieve let's say a 125% rec709 standard which an led projector can definitely achieve so led projectors will have good colors too but the colors may not be as natural as a lamp based projector can deliver so in the era of instant and quick deliveries we all want a projector also to turn on fast now the best projector that you can go for in these cases is the led projector because it is going to have an instant power on facility which a lamp based projector will not have because a lamp based projector will take a lot of time to turn on the lamp to the fullest power and then you will get the screen though there are few times wherein we have checked it with the led projectors also that not all the projectors are that instant power on it still takes 15 to 20 seconds as the power on time one of the most common complaints of projector 
and mostly the DLP projectors is that you face a lot of rainbow effects in it. Now, rainbow effects are something which you will always see more happening in the lamp based projectors. The LED projectors will not see that level of rainbow effects. They are reduced to a certain extent, but they are not fully disappeared. LED projectors are very, very compact and that's why used for portable applications. Because with only LED as the light source, you do not need a lot of cooling fans, you do not need air filters. And with all of these pairs coming to a reduction, the compactness of the projector can very well be achieved. On the contrary, with the lamp based projectors, they are always going to stay bulky because the lamp will have the light source which is going to require a lot of cooling and that's where the lot cooling fans will come into place and the air filter will be an extra pocket which will not make the projectors as handy or as compact or as portable as an LED projector. Now with regards to the after cell service, a lamp based projector will have too many elements that require after cell service but eventually the cost may not be very very high. For instance, the air filter will cost you around 800 to 1000 rupees. The changing of lamp may vary based upon the model to model, but it will still be between 5000 to at the most 50,000 rupees. And the other spare parts of the projector will again be not very, very expensive. Whereas for LED projector, you do not have a facility to change any of the spare parts. The only thing you can do is either change the light source or change the entire electronic motherboard panel of that projector due to which the after cell service cost in a LED projector is going to be high. Now finally coming down to the PESA, lamp based projector will always help you save some money compared to the LED projector. When it comes to practical experiences, if you are someone looking for a projector in your bright rooms, you want a great picture, great contrast and you don't mind saving some money out there, then lamp based projectors are the ones that you can go for. And if you are someone who is looking to spend a little more, want a longer lifespan of you know light source and is okay to compromise a little on the color space then the led projectors would be the perfect choice for you to go for now if you're looking for a longer lifespan as well as a great color picture then laser projectors can be something that you can go for and i would love to know from you in the comment section that which one would you consider for your requirements whether it will be lamp led or laser and in case you want us to compare laser with either lamp or LED, do let us know that as well in the comments below. Till then, I Tanmay Mehta, your home cinema consultant or home theater wale bhaiya, we'll see you again in the next video.